Hey guys, it's Nikki. Welcome back to another video. I'm vlogging. I got a little bit of a late start to the vlog this week. It's Wednesday. Um, I've just been really busy. We are, we wrapped up midterms a couple weeks ago. We're getting into like the last month of the semester. So things have been crazy, but you know, we're doing good. We're thriving, but I had a mishap this morning. I spilt coffee all over my hoodie on the way to class. Basically, long story short, there was a crack in my lid and I had absolutely no idea until it got to the point where the coffee was below the lid. Um, also, don't mind my crusty and dusty nails. I'm gonna go get them redone in a couple days because guess what? We're leaving for Phoenix in two weeks. So it's just lots of things that are gonna be happening, obviously. With me leaving for Phoenix in two weeks, I'm trying to keep up on like laundry, especially like my personal laundry, Jason's. I don't really care if his starts to pile up because my personal laundry, I'm trying to keep up with just because of the fact that we're literally, like when I say we, I mean like we're, as in me and you, we're going to Phoenix. I would like to vlog. I don't know how like up to key my family is gonna be with me vlogging this Phoenix trip. But I would like to vlog. I think it would be so much fun. But I don't know. But yes, I'm trying to make sure I keep up with everything. I got my dress and it looks perfect for the wedding. I have shoes to match it. Um, the only outfit I have to figure out is what I'm going to wear for this. So the day after the wedding, we're doing like a luncheon. And we're basically where the bride is going to have immediate family and bridal party together to like celebrate them being newlyweds i don't really know what it is but the attire for everything i'm sitting the attire for everything is like formal it's awfully dark in this corner i'm so sorry but the wedding's formal and this event is like semi-formal so i have to dress nice so i'm trying to find an outfit because i'm getting a pair of sorry i'm so jittery because i had coffee and it's like Woo! I'm getting a pair of Balenciaga heels in tomorrow, which wasn't technically for this trip. I was going to order them regardless, but now since I found out about this event the day after the wedding, I figured these would be perfect to wear. They're super sparkly. I'm obsessed with them. I'm going to real I'm going to reveal them on my TikTok, so please watch my TikTok so you're up to date. Um I'm also what am I going to be doing today? I'm going to be planning out a vlogmas schedule. Yes, a Vlogmas schedule. Um, Vlogmas starts December 1st. So, baby, we are a month until Vlogmas. Um, there is a couple makeup looks that I am going to be filming this month that I will be uploading in Vlogmas. There's also going to be a couple videos that I am going to pre-film this month so I can upload for Vlogmas. Reason being... Um, a lot of the reason being, I'm having surgery December 13th. Now, I don't do Vlogmas from the 1st to the 31st. I do it from the 1st to the 25th, technically the 26th, because if you've watched my Vlogmas videos in the past, last year was honestly such a big flop. Uh, yeah, I don't even count last year. I honestly want to delete like more than half of those videos, but I'm gonna leave them up on my channel anyway. But Last year was honestly such a huge flop for me for Vlogmas. I was not in a good place at all. But I figured for this Vlogmas, we're going to plan ahead. But I have to have surgery on December 13th. With me having surgery December 13th, that basically means that like at the halfway point, I'm going to be down for the count. So for those couple of days that I'm basically not going to be filming... I'm probably just gonna have pre-film uploads ready to go so that way I can be like, hey man, you know, <laughs> not really, not really looking forward to Vlogmas here. Not really looking forward to showing my face on camera for Vlogmas, but I might film like my surgery experience and stuff and put that in a video, but yeah, we never know. But yeah, um, so usually how I do vlogmas let's talk about it so with my vlogmas schedule um I always talk about this every year but what I do is I upload the day after 
So day one, I upload on the second. Day two, I upload on the third. The reason why I do that is because some days I'm going to be vlogging and some days I'm not going to be vlogging. So it just makes it so much easier to do it the day after because then that way I can vlog that whole day, edit the video that night, and get it uploaded that next morning. So that's the plan. I do plan on all my videos to go up by noon the next day. Um, whenever I upload YouTube videos, that's usually about the time I try to get them up by or I schedule them to get them up by is by noon. I don't know why. I just really like that time. I feel like it's easy to remember. <laughs> so yes, all my videos I'm going to be filming, editing, and getting uploaded the next day by noon. Um, and yeah, so that's kind of the plan. I'm gonna be honest, I don't really have a plan of, I want to do a mixture, I don't really have a plan of like what I'm gonna do yet, but I want to do a mixture, I want to do makeup looks, I want to do sit down talking videos, I want to do tags, and obviously I'm gonna do like vlogs and everything, so it's just gonna be kind of like a mixture of stuff, um, I'm gonna try to get Jason involved in some videos because just, I feel like that would be fun. I don't know if he's going to want to. He's not really, he supports the TikTok and the YouTube, but he doesn't like being on camera, but he likes to watch my stuff. So we'll kind of see. Um, but yeah, I mean, obviously I'm definitely going to be doing like a Black Friday haul and stuff in here. I'm going to basically be doing like a lot of day in the lives because I feel like those are really easy to film. Um, and yeah, I'm probably going to do like a Christmas shopping vlog gift wrapping one um because I'm obviously my goal is to be done Christmas shopping and my gifts to people gift wrapped all done by the time my surgery comes the girl's gonna be down for the count for two weeks she's not gonna feel like wrapping gifts um so yeah plus I'm gonna be on crutches so I'm not gonna even be able to carry the gifts inside but that's the plan for anyone who's worried and or concerned um and yeah so that's that's that um and yeah that's my day today I'm gonna be planning out vlogmas and I'm also going to be um doing all that what's up friends it is thursday morning i have an exam to take later but mm, okay i thought i saw something weird on my face it's probably the lighting it is like rainy outside so the lighting's a little weird but i just did my makeup um i'm gonna run and go get some lunch somewhere soon because i'm getting hungry um and yeah i just did my makeup and then i'm gonna go pick up some food and go to class, take my test, and I actually work the store again today. So I ended up working the store last night for a couple hours. Um, and I'm going to work the store again tonight. And then tomorrow I have off. I'm so excited. This is my first Friday off in so long. But I have to go shopping today when I leave class because um, I'm going to go shopping at the mall that I work at. So I'm already there. But I have a wedding to go to that's in town for a cousin on my dad's side next Friday on the 11th. And then I have a wedding, the out of town wedding on my mom's side on the 18th, which obviously everything is like picked out for that. But I need to find an outfit for this winter wedding here. I don't know how the weather is going to be, but I imagine it's, I mean, it's probably going to be like nice-ish, but also cold. The weather's been really weird right now. But I don't have any lip products on yet because I'm going to go eat, obviously. But I kind of wanted to show you guys something exciting. I'm getting my Balenciaga shoes in today. And I need to, I want to incorporate them into an outfit that I'm going to bring for Phoenix next in two weeks. Um, God, I got to start picking out outfits here soon. I'm going to lose my mind. Next thing I have to think about is my ride to the airport because I have not asked anyone yet. I'm probably just going to have... My mom take me because luckily when she gets off of work, she can just swing through and come get me because my flight leaves at 6. But I board at like 5.30 or something like that. So at least when she gets off, we can skedaddle to the airport. But I'm going to go put some pants on and go get some food. Whew, 
it is like god awful windy outside good freaking lord so i just got done with my test i actually got done like 30 minutes ago and then i decided to turn in a assignment that is due tomorrow i smacked my head getting in my car can you tell i decided to turn in a homework assignment that's due tomorrow because i had extra time i just sat in the cafeteria and finished it real quick um and yeah, so I'm going to head to the store, and then um, I'm actually going to be there like an hour and a half early, so I'm not going to go straight inside. I am just going to go shop around for a little bit. I need to find an outfit for this casual wedding next week. I want to find like a jumpsuit, so that is my agenda for today. I'm going to hit Francesca's, and I think I'm also going to go to Altered State and see what any of them have. Because I want to be able to have it, like, this is something I can continue to wear and, like, wear to work. I don't want to just, like, you know, wear it once and call it good. Hi, welcome to Starbucks. What can I get started for you today? Hi, can I get a venti peppermint mocha? Yeah, of course. And then what else for you today? And that's it. Awesome, that'll be 6.69 for you today. Thank you. It is Saturday morning. I am in the Starbucks line. <laughs> There's like two people in front of me. Um, but yeah, God, I look so weird with this light or the brake light, but yep, I am headed to work. I work today, tomorrow, and Monday. So not super eventful, but yes, I work. Um, Usually I work Mondays and then a weekend day. However, I couldn't work this last Monday, which was Halloween, because um, I had a dentist appointment mid-morning and it was at a really weird time that I couldn't like find coverage for. And so I just decided to work a full weekend. The good thing with weekends is you do get weekend pay. So, I mean, it kind of makes up for it. But yeah, so I'm getting my coffee and going to work. Hello, you f hello friends. Oh, that was so weird. I was turning. So I just pulled out of the Starbucks. <laughs> I decided to try that caramel brulee latte. Um, I've never tried it before, so I got it this morning. It's actually pretty good. It's still pretty hot, so I'm letting it cool down for a little bit. But I'm on my way to work. Um, I work today, which is Sunday, and then I work tomorrow, and then. I'm off for the rest of the week as far as um, the hospital's concerned. Um, and then I don't work till next Saturday. I do work the store um, one night a week, but I mean, it's fine. So, yeah. Um, I'm headed to work right now. Yesterday, when I got out of work, I planned on vlogging and I kind of started putting a little bit of the Christmas stuff up. Um, Tuesday is going to be the big day where I pretty much do everything um, because I just have lab on Tuesday and then I don't have to work the hospital or the store or anything. Um, I originally picked up a small bonus shift at the hospital, but the girls, I picked it up from somebody's shift and they decided that they were just going to work the whole thing and not to worry about it. So I don't have to go in, which I was kind of looking forward to the bonus pay, but at the same time right now, I'm a little excited because that means Tuesday I can get all of my Christmas stuff up. Like I said, I had already started like some of it, so I don't have to worry about um, doing like the outside lights or anything. I already got that done. So that means that I get to do everything, which I'm excited about because I wanted to have everything up by the end of um, like this upcoming week anyways. So I'm really happy that I will <laughs> and I'm really happy that everything will be just so. So that's good. Um, and yeah, so I'm going to head to work and I will see you guys then. What's up you guys? We're coming from our garage. Um, right now I'm getting, I'm out of breath. 
I've been going up and down the stairs the last few times. Right now, I'm getting the Christmas coats out of the garage, which is why my vehicle is not in the garage because I'm getting the Christmas totes out of here so that way I can, um, so that way I can like get all the Christmas stuff up. I've gotten a, like, I've gotten a big start on like the hanging stuff and like the tedious stuff like garland and the outside stuff is all up, but I gotta start doing like the trees. So, and I need to set up the big tree, which is gonna be the goal for either tonight or this weekend because I wanna decorate it by like next Tuesday at the latest. So, this is what we're doing. My plan is, you guys see this like huge empty wall here on the side? My plan is I wanna get a huge garage like shelving unit and that's something I might have like me and my dad work on this spring because a lot of these like extra stuff, a lot of this stuff is like storage and we don't have like a storage closet in this because we live in a apartment townhouse. There's not like a storage closet or like at my old apartment, I had a storage closet on my balcony. So a lot of the storage stuff could go in there and it was just like out of the way. So that's the plan that I want to do on this wall. So then a lot of like the totes for like Christmas, extra storage stuff, like storage stuff, things that like we're not using or it's just like storage stuff that we don't need in the house. Um, we can keep on the shelving and it gives us a little bit more room in the front of the garage. And then that way I can kind of sweep out this garage and spray because we have a big spider problem in the garage. Like in the corners, there's tons of like spiders, roly polies, everything. So that's kind of the plan, but I'm gonna carry, where are they at from here? The little totes, the two, um, I'm trying to point little totes right here. I'm going to carry those inside because, um, those have like inside stuff I can start. This big one and then that big white long one behind the little totes, that's the Christmas tree and this has a medium tree in it. And I need Jason's help because they're a little long for like my body to grab. So I need his help carrying them in, but I'm going to carry these two upstairs. Then I'm gonna start dinner because Jason's gonna be home soon. Start dinner, get some food in, and then we can finish decorating. What's up you guys? It's a little bit later. It's actually the week that I leave for Phoenix, but I just got my hair done. You can probably see it looks a lot different from the first couple of pictures or clips you've seen, but I got my hair done and I work the store in an hour, so I'm going to grab a bite to eat and then just kind of head out there a little bit early. It is freezing. Now, I have on a little bit of makeup today, nothing crazy, but if I had it my way, I would not be working today. I could have honestly just taken this whole week off, but I decided not to do that. I probably should have because it would have given me a little extra time, but you know. It is what it is. So here we are. Yeah, I am gonna go. There's a couple of just like smaller places like fast food to eat right next to the mall that I'm just gonna swing through and get something, just eat in the car and then head to the store. So I'm super happy. Um, I'm planning on it to be a very slow night. So I plan on just doing homework the whole time, which probably sounds really bad. Like, why would you say that? But I plan on it being really slow. So I'm going to get some food and then I will talk to you guys later. Good morning, everyone. It is Wednesday morning. Um, hair is looking some type of way. I have a lot to do today. It is about to be seven o'clock in the morning. I'm on my way to go to class. And then after I go to class, I'm going to get my nails done, get my brows done. I have a tattoo appointment later. Shocker, I know. So just a bunch of fun things today. Um, I need to pack, so that's gotta get done. And yeah, 
gotta finish putting a couple of the Christmas stuff up. I know that at this time last week, I'm like, oh, I'll get it up by this weekend. Yeah, this, the weekend came. We had such a busy weekend. I had my cousin's wedding that was in town. We went to a Kansas City Chiefs game and I had to work. Like there was so much stuff going on. But nonetheless, um, yeah, I worked the store last night. It was very boring to say the least. Um, if you want me to be 100% transparent, it was just, wow. I've never had a shift that dead before. We literally sold like $8 for the whole day. Yeah, it was bad. But anyways, we're gonna go get some coffee and go to class. I'm at Starbucks and I'm in line. I'm gonna get some coffee. And guess what? It snowed last night. Look at it. You can see all the snow on the ground in the parking lot. Yeah, it snowed. I actually am kind of happy because it feels like it's like officially holiday season, but at the same time, I'm not happy because I do not like snow. But luckily tomorrow, I will be in Phoenix where there's no snow. I cannot believe I leave for Arizona tomorrow, you guys. That's just crazy to me. And I got a lot of stuff to get done. Okay, <laughs> I'm done with class. I had a hat on, so my hair looks wild. It is freezing. It's actually like actively snowing. You can kind of see it. I'm leaving campus right now. I'm gonna go to the nail salon because <laughs> I'm trying out a new nail salon that my friend told me about. They're a little bit more expensive than where I usually go, but their work literally looks fantastic. And I love me a good nail salon of nice people, fantastic work. They can do almost anything you ask. That's something I've been having a really hard time finding is I haven't like, I've been trying to find a nail salon where they can just do everything and everything and like it's not like a big hassle with getting your nails done the salon I was going to the last couple of times I liked but they were always just such in a rush and they didn't really take the time to like really make sure I liked the style before they finished and I'm not one like unless they look absolutely awful I'll be like listen I really don't like these but if it's like it looks fine and everything and like even it's if it's not exactly what I wanted, but it looks fine, I'm still gonna just keep it. But she said they're all super nice, they're all super talented, they really, they're super thorough, they take their time, so I'm gonna try a new nail salon. They literally just opened, it's like 9.20, they open at, I think, 9.30. By the time I get over there, it'll be like after 9.30. So, we're gonna try that. I have to go to the bank. <laughs> deposit some money. I have a brow appointment to get my brows waxed at noon and then I have a tattoo appointment and then I'm going to decorate the tree. So just tons of stuff going on today and I have to pack. No time to do anything but we're doing it. Here's um, the nails for anyone who wanted to see. Just got a nice little nude pink, some rose gold little sparkle stripes. Yeah. I think they're really, really cute. This is all my natural nails. Um, I didn't do any tips or anything, and then we cut them really short just because a couple of my nails kind of broke off. So we wanted to keep them short so that way they're a little nubby, but especially through the holidays, I like having shorter nails. It's easier to do stuff. It's also easier to work with shorter nails. So I do keep my nails roughly around this length. I let them grow for a bit and then I'll usually cut them back. So yeah, this is them. They're super cute. Okay, so my brows are done. So are my lips. She put a little bit of brow gel in today just so they looked a little bit more put together, but we're waxed. I even got my upper lip waxed because as I was there in the lighting, I was like, ooh, we should do that. <laughs> so we did that and one of my friends um like joined the place that I go to for waxing and like referred me like saying that like I referred her or whatever 
it's called so I got a discount I love getting I got 30% off my whole service today which was great I love that but I went to Target I just got like some travel stuff so well this isn't a travel thing but I got a new deodorant because my deodorant is like on its last leg it's starting to crack so i just went ahead and got a new deodorant i got a little travel body wash this is just the olay hydration one these last me a while because um i also take my little travel size products on road trips when jason and i like to go on little weekend road trips i take these with because they're super simple to pack so I got a new one because I ran out of all my travel stuff. I got just some little travel. I know people like don't like makeup wipes. I got some little travel makeup wipes just because um, although I do bring like face wash and everything, I typically don't bring my big old cleansing balm just because it's humongous and there's just not a lot of room to pack it. So I always just bring a little bit of makeup wipes and it's also nice to have in case you have like a makeup problem and then I got a little baby Batiste dry shampoo and just the original um like the original just standard color which is just like the white um usually I get it colored like the color like the brunette one but um they didn't have that so I just got the regular one but yeah so that's my little mini target haul i'm gonna head to go get my tattoo done um and yeah so that's pretty much that um i just wanted to run to target since i was gonna pass it real quick pick up some stuff so i can pack tonight because that is on the agenda got my purse i have my suitcases in the garage because my stepdad's just about here and we're headed to the airport i'm actually really excited because i have not seen my family since January, believe it or not. The last time I saw them was January. So I'm very excited to spend some time with them. So let's go to the airport. Okay, it is wedding day here in Arizona. Not for me, but for my cousin. And I'm outside at the Airbnb. Look at it. It's so nice out here. Do you see Snickers in the doorway? Snickers! That's my family's dog. But yeah, we're here, it is gorgeous outside, and I am ready for the wedding, and we're gonna go to it! Actually so excited for this, um, it's gorgeous, my, the guys look really good, um, obviously won't see the bride until I get to the ceremony, but the guys got ready here at our Airbnb, and I had to help tie many ties and fix many collars so they're all looking good now i supervised yeah, this is what my hair looks like since i got it done um looks super cute i'm obsessed and then here's the tattoo it says lover it's more healed now it's i got it in red ink um the stencil is pretty much all the way off it's mainly just like a little swollen now but yeah this is the this is the wedding look. I'm wearing this dress and everything. You guys can see the full reveal on TikTok, so follow me on TikTok. And yeah, I'm just really happy. Beautiful day for a wedding. <coughs> Hi guys, you recognize the bedroom because I am home. I look like a hot mess. So I've been home for a few hours. I actually got home around 2 p.m. today because we went and picked up some lunch and so I've been home for quite a while it's almost 10 o'clock um, I'm working on like trying to unpack I turned on all the Christmas lights because I felt like it um you guys I have so much stuff to do it's like actually insane I feel like my brain is going to explode um, but yeah, I'm just in the process of unpacking and, um, tomorrow night I work the store for a couple hours or technically I work for three and a half. It's just some small, it's Black Friday week, as you know, um, we're going to be getting ready for our promotions to start on Friday. So 
this week is just going to be insane. So I'm working Monday through Friday between hospital and store because I obviously work Thanksgiving on Wednesday and Thursday. And then I have the store Monday, Tuesday and Friday. Then I have the weekend off, which will be nice. Like, yeah. So the trip was amazing. Honestly, I loved it, but it was just, it was really, really busy. Um, my cousin got married. There was a lot of stuff to do for the wedding. Like just activity wise, it was a very big extravagant wedding. So just lots of stuff to do. And we really didn't get a time to spend together like as a family like we wanted because there was literally no time. Like I'm not even kidding. There was literally no time to do anything just because of how crazy it's been. So yeah. I don't know, but I'm home now. I'm about to take a shower, get in my jammies. I took a fat nap. That's also why I didn't vlog right away. I look crazy. I took a two and a half hour nap when I got home because I was just so tired and exhausted, but we did it. But yeah, I think I'm gonna start doing on TikTok, like get ready with me is where I do my makeup and then I show you my outfit after just cause I think that's like super fun, random, but. I want to do that but yeah okay I'm gonna shower now because it's needed your girl's exhausted so let's shower I'll talk to you guys tomorrow thing or should I say good afternoon um yeah I'm actually gonna complete this vlog today it's just a couple minutes after after 12 o'clock and I'm going to the grocery store right now today is Sunday it's a recovery day from all the holidays and I cleaned all morning. I've got my last load of laundry going and I'm going to the grocery store. Jason's spending time with his family because his brother's in town. So I figured that this was a great moment for me to um, get some stuff done. So I unpacked my suitcase finally. It's been a week today since I got back and I have not unpacked it because of the fact that Good Lord, it was so busy. I worked Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Had Well, I also worked Thursday, but then I did Thanksgiving, worked Black Friday, and then we hung out with Jason's family. And then Saturday, I did Thanksgiving with my dad's side. So it just was a lot. It was a lot to do. It was a huge busy week. So not a lot of cleaning, not a lot of stuff got done. So that's what I'm doing today. Um, so, I wanted to be at the grocery store by like 10, but I also forgot it's Sunday, so a lot of stuff open up later, so it's probably a good time that I'm going now, um, and I want to try to get some Christmas shopping done this afternoon, so we'll, we'll see how it goes. Mm -hmm. 